So here I'm testing uh, whether my uh, UV cure adhesive will work through this polyimid tubing. I'm going to uh, apply some UV cure to these micro wires and then slide the polyimid tubing over it and see if I can get the cure to make effect through the uh, polyimid tubing. And we're going to try the thin uh, poly. The thin uh, UV cure adhesive, that's the one I probably will use. So I've got the UV cure adhesive on there. Now I'm going to slide the uh, tubing over it. I can see it wicking up inside there. So I can see it's uh, wicked from here to there, which, uh, and there's also a little there. But that's a good amount there. That's enough to test with. So now I'm going to hit it with the UV gun. And I'm going to give it a lot of energy. A lot more than I normally would have. I'm going to turn it around and hit it from the bottom too. I'm going to see if this is uh, cured up. I'm going to do a few tests. I'm going to cut it in half. And I'm also just going to squeeze it there and see if I can see if it's liquid or not. It appears to still be liquid. And I'm still able to slide it. So that's not a good sign. So evidently I cannot use. See how it just slides along there? That's not good. Evidently, I cannot use the UV cure um, inside a polyimid tubing. Evidently, it blocks it. So that's a good thing to know. I'm going to have to switch over to an epoxy cure, which is uh, a 20, at least a 24-hour cure for that.